Governments are starting to regulate cryptocurrency more closely, which means people who own digital assets will have to pay taxes. Different countries have different tax rules for cryptocurrencies. Some are making it easy for crypto startups by offering good tax conditions, while others are making it harder by imposing strict regulations and higher taxes. Buckle up as we uncover the top worst countries for crypto taxes. But before we get started, let's make sure we're all on the same page. What is cryptocurrency? Cryptocurrency is a type of digital money that uses cryptography for security and works on decentralized networks called blockchains. Unlike regular money issued by governments, cryptocurrencies aren't controlled by any one authority, making them resistant to government interference or manipulation. How does cryptocurrency work? Cryptocurrencies use blockchain technology, which is a decentralized ledger that records all transactions across a network of computers. When you make a cryptocurrency transaction, it's grouped with other transactions in a block. Once the block is full, it's added to the blockchain, creating a permanent record. This blockchain forms a chain of blocks, hence the name. Before we go through our list, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss an update from us. All right, let's get started. Number 1. The Netherlands Crypto holders in the Netherlands are required to pay taxes on their crypto assets, irrespective of whether they have been sold or not. The tax authority of the Netherlands, Belastingdienst, imposes high income taxes on crypto assets. For instance, income over 73,030 euros is subject to a tax rate of 49.50%. Additionally, activities such as crypto lending and airdrops are taxed at 31% while taxes of over 30% are levied on mining and staking activities. These tax regulations are crucial for crypto holders to understand and comply with, as failure to do so can result in penalties or legal consequences. Thus, it's essential for those involved in crypto trading or other related activities to keep accurate records of their transactions and consult with tax professionals if necessary. Understanding and adhering to these tax laws ensures compliance with Dutch regulations, promoting a smooth and legal operation within the country's crypto sphere. Number 2. France The French government generally supports blockchain-based technologies, albeit under conditions that are not particularly favorable for investors. France imposes a 30% flat tax rate for capital gains derived from any form of crypto asset applicable to gains exceeding 305 euros per year. However, tax rates for professional crypto traders and miners tend to be on the higher side, reaching up to 45%. Despite the tax implications, France has been making efforts to develop a conducive environment for blockchain technology. Initiatives such as the Pact Law and the experimentation with a digital euro suggest the country's willingness to embrace innovation. The French government also encourages blockchain-based projects and startups, aiming to foster technological advancement and economic growth. Number 3. Spain As of January 1, 2024, Spain remains cautious and conservative regarding cryptocurrencies. Crypto investors are now obliged to report their possession of cryptocurrencies and any operations carried out using them. These reports are required to cover balances in virtual currencies, transactions involving them, and virtual currencies held abroad. The State Agency for Tax Administration of Spain imposes high capital gains taxes for crypto sales, trades, and deposits, ranging between 19% and 28%. Additionally, a general income tax is applied to crypto payments for goods and services, mining, and other professional activities like staking. The tax rate for these activities varies from 19% to 47%. The regulations demonstrate the government's intention to closely monitor and regulate the cryptocurrency market to ensure compliance with tax obligations. These measures are put in place to manage the potential risks associated with cryptocurrencies and to ensure the integrity of the financial system.
Number 4. Japan Japan's national tax agency imposes a normal crypto tax ranging from 5% to 45%. Additionally, a municipal tax of 10% is applicable. Consequently, if you have crypto capital gains in Japan, you may be subject to a maximum tax rate of up to 55%. However, if your crypto profit is less than 200,000 Japanese yen, you are exempt from paying taxes. The high cryptocurrency tax policy acts as a significant deterrent to crypto adoption in Japan. Moreover, these tax rates hinder the influx of a large number of crypto investors and traders into this Asian country. The strict tax regime may stifle innovation and the growth of the crypto market within Japan, potentially putting the nation at a competitive disadvantage compared to other countries with more lenient tax policies regarding cryptocurrencies. Consequently, this situation prompts a call for reconsideration and possible adjustments to encourage a more vibrant crypto economy. Number 5. India In the 2022 budget, India unveiled its latest crypto taxation policy. According to this fiscal plan, investors are mandated to pay a flat 30% tax on crypto assets, coupled with a 4% cess and applicable surcharges. Moreover, there is an additional 1% tax deducted at source to be paid. This TDS applies to crypto trading activities exceeding 50,000 Indian rupees in a single financial year. India's new crypto taxation policy aims to regulate the growing cryptocurrency market, ensuring transparency and boosting revenue. However, it has received mixed reactions. Critics fear it may stifle innovation and deter investors, while proponents believe it will bring stability and legitimacy. The true impact remains to be seen. Number 6. Denmark Denmark has implemented a policy that considers each cryptocurrency transaction as a financial contract, subjecting them to capital gains tax. Consequently, Individuals are required to pay a substantial tax of 42% on their crypto capital gains. Additionally, income derived from crypto assets is also heavily taxed, with rates ranging from 37.1% to 52.1%, depending on one's income bracket. Denmark's tax framework imposes a tax on crypto capital gains, reflecting a robust approach to regulating and taxing cryptocurrency activities. The government aims to ensure fair taxation and contribution to tax revenue. This stance mirrors a global trend among governments to establish clear taxation policies for cryptocurrencies. Denmark's objective is to regulate the crypto market and ensure fair taxation of income, whether from traditional or digital assets. Therefore, individuals trading cryptocurrency in Denmark should be aware of the tax implications and plan transactions accordingly. Number 7. Canada In Canada, cryptocurrency taxation has become a critical issue, with regulations subject to change. Presently, the tax structure entails a 50% levy on capital gains and 100% on income derived from cryptocurrency activities. Tax rates fluctuate between 15% and 33%. In summary, Individual investors are required to pay taxes on only 50% of their crypto capital gains. Conversely, professional traders are obligated to pay taxes on 100% of their trading income or profit. The dynamic nature of cryptocurrency trading and its tax implications underscores the importance of staying informed and seeking professional advice to ensure compliance with the prevailing regulations. As the cryptocurrency landscape evolves, Investors and traders alike must remain updated on any alterations to the tax framework to effectively manage their financial obligations and avoid potential penalties. Consulting with a tax expert is advisable to navigate the complexities of cryptocurrency taxation in Canada. Number 8. United States The Internal Revenue Service taxes cryptocurrency based on your tax bracket. Cryptocurrency transactions, including buying, selling, and trading, are subject to taxation. Moreover, short-term and long-term capital gains are taxed differently. 
long-term crypto capital gains can attract a tax rate between 0% and 20%, depending on your income bracket. On the other hand, short-term crypto capital gains are taxed at ordinary income tax rates, which range from 10% to 37%. Cryptocurrency gains are classified as short-term or long-term, depending on how long the asset is held. Holding for over a year makes it a long-term capital gain. Holding for less than a year makes it a short-term capital gain. Keep detailed records of all transactions, including dates and values, to accurately report gains and losses at tax time. Failure to report income can lead to penalties or criminal prosecution. Consult a tax professional for compliance and to optimize your tax situation. Number 9. South Africa The South African Revenue Service maintains stringent regulations regarding cryptocurrency taxation, necessitating compliance from investors. As per these regulations, individuals are obligated to pay taxes of up to 18% on their capital gains from cryptocurrencies. Moreover, income derived from crypto assets is subject to heavy taxation, ranging from 18% to 45%. This income tax is applicable to various crypto-related activities, including referral rewards, crypto trading, mining, and staking. SARS's firm stance on crypto taxation underscores the importance of understanding and adhering to tax obligations in South Africa's crypto space. Failure to comply with these regulations can result in penalties and legal consequences. Therefore, it is crucial for cryptocurrency investors and traders to maintain accurate records and fulfill their tax obligations to avoid any potential issues with the authorities. Number 10. United Kingdom In the United Kingdom, there's a tax-free allowance available for crypto capital gains, allowing individuals to earn up to £12,300 without being subject to taxes. However, if you exceed this limit, you will be required to pay a tax of either 10% or 20%, depending on the tax slab. The complexity increases when it comes to the crypto income tax policy. Beyond a personal allowance of up to £12,570, your income tax rate can range from 20% to 45%, depending on your total income. This means that it's essential to keep track of your earnings and be prepared to pay the necessary taxes ensuring compliance with the UK tax regulations regarding cryptocurrency. Understanding the tax implications of cryptocurrency in the UK is crucial for all investors to avoid any potential problems with HM revenue and customs. Always ensure you stay informed and up to date with the latest tax regulations to meet your obligations. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss an update from us.